Hey guys, welcome back to Wolf's Gap, Tennessee. Here in the middle of winter, and things are not going great here on the farm. Oh, man, that's just another one right there. I did sell a little bit of the corn. Uh, had about 240,000 liters off of the fields I harvested and the price was decent so I went ahead and sold one load oat prices have gone up pretty good so I'm selling that right now but I have some bad news and I don't know what's causing it but I had this problem last year in game before I changed to a new geo the barley ended up uh, not growing and then it wilted all of a sudden well guess what happened again all of this canola all of this canola here is wilted it was about 30 something percent uh, growth stage and then just wilted same here both fields total loss but that's not all it gets even worse so as you can see this field which was how barley. If you remember the last episode, it was uh, like 30% growth. And guess what happened? It just all of a sudden wilted. So, that's not good. Oh, wait, it gets even worse. Let me pull this truck over here. It gets even worse. It gets even worse. Let's go take a look. So if you remember, if you've watched uh, other episodes, that I had planted this field in grass. Well, it never grew. It got to about 67% and just stopped growing. Never grew, then we got a bunch of rain. Well, now it's winter, so it's reverted back to the first growth stage. I can't win. I cannot win. So, I am out of hay. And it gets even worse. Not only am I out of hay, I totally underestimated how much TMR I would need. I'm out of TMR. So I am in a pickle this winter. I have no hay. I do have plenty of silage and straw. So what I need to do now is I've got this hay. I went down to the store and bought a load of hay. So I'm going to have to get the tractor over here. It has the TMR mixer hooked up already. Got to make a little bit of TMR. And I did get this field planted before I do that. Uh, it has wheat. It's growing. The fields that I harvested the corn off of, which was 20, and this one, I replanted with canola again. So hopefully it'll work out.
I do have to say though the cows are producing enough slurry that I do not have to uh, buy I haven't had to buy any fertilizer here in a long time there should be about three bells into that mixer should be about right And then I still have some straw here in the silo. But there is some. I thought I was out of hay. Wait a minute. Well, I don't know what happened there, but looks like I still have hay. We grab the wheel loader here and. Get that pushed back to the back. I tell you, I really like this wheel loader. It, it turns real smooth. Really good mod. Alright, well I'm going to get this TMR made up. I won't bore you with this process. Now that I look like a fool after not knowing what I had in the silo. But I guess it all worked out. Alright, we're here on the next day. Figured before the ground freezes. If it does, I'm not sure if it will or not with this geo. Go ahead and start turning this uh, withered plants under. That way I can be ready for uh, the planting as soon as I'm able to next next spring. Before I do that, I'm going to take a look at this. Yeah, I got some TMR now. A whole bunch. I imagine that's probably close to 300, maybe a 350,000 liters. Should be set for a while. I do appreciate you watching this episode, and if you found it entertaining, give me a like. If you have any comments, suggestions, or criticism, feel free to leave that below in the comments section. And if you have not done so already, I would appreciate if you would subscribe to the channel and click the bell. That way you'll be notified for any future content. Thanks so much for watching.